Well, howdy diddly dandy there, chums. I'm loading back into the expedition and we're moving on to phase two of the expedition. And I haven't built a base here as yet. I mean, I put down a base computer, but it's too small to actually upload from last episode. But we can always come back to that and do that as and when. Okay, so let's go and have a look at the old expedition. And let's see what we need to do and next, shall we, people? Chikapa! Okay, right, so on to phase two. And we've got to reach the second place, angling destination or whatever. Okay, let's uh, jump in the old ship then. Let's take to the sky and let's let let's make that happen, shall we? Zoom! Pow pow! Chicka boom boom! And there we go. Into the old galactic map. And because I've fully upgraded my engines, I should be able to do this in one hit. I'd like to hope I can anyway. Yes, yes, I can indeedy duty. I can. Heck yeah. Okay, we've arrived, located in the system of space. And then we're going to swing it around to the rendezvous location. There we are, ringed planet over said yonder hill. Let's fly on over there. There is no hills. I jest. Okay, chums, last episode I ran out of tritium, if you remember. I'm going to fly into the ring of this planet. Zoom. Let me into your rings. I guess. Once you go into the rings... Mm, I'll just have to backtrack on myself a little bit there. You're going to find that it's littered. Littered with asteroids, people. So you can just shoot the fudge out of these asteroids and get all the tritium you need. Like, yeah! Yeah, I'm shooting these roids. Take that, asteroids of evil! Like, yeah! Rocks of floatiness. Oh my god! They're impacting my ship's hull. Alright, anyway, I'm going to shoot these. I've got loads of fuel, so I don't have to worry about tritium ever again, people inside the viewers. Okay, chums, I just also went to the Nexus and um, I spent a lot of that salvage data on getting a load of base parts, mainly land the base parts, because I'm imagining if we've got to build a base, they're probably going to give us some underwater base parts. Right, I'm going to fly towards where that comms ball is that just popped up, because normally when you see the first comms ball, that's where we've got to go. All right, well, let's land here then, and let's see what we get. Kaboom! I've arrived, decated. I guess, largest planet. And we've got to go up there. Hello, everyone. Free Hong Kong. What's going on? Okay, whatever. Okay, let's interact with this then. Ancient marker hums at a frequency that burrows deep into my being, filling me with a voice of the Corvax echoes. Knowledge paves the way to understand the probability of the Atlas. Spoken fragments, the Atlas interfaces are their shadows. The monoliths are their scattered children. Together they convey wisdom and of the infinite. They must be understood. Okay. Um, yeah, give us, give us some language. There we go. All right. Okay. Well, we've done that then. Right out. Exosuit storage. Okay. And this one. Land a message from the Angular. Okay. All right. How do you go about doing that? Fish up a message in a bottle from the Angular. Locate a suitable body of water and begin fishing. Equip this fishing rod. Is there anything special about doing it at all? Message in the bottle. An Angular has toured the galaxy in search of the perfect catch. Follow their footsteps. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. But this one. Is there anything else that I can do? Okay. Hmm. Fine. Oh man, all the wa all the sounds gone janky here. All right, well, let's see if we can get a message in a bottle then. Message in a bottle. Sweet. Zoom. Wow. Keep forgetting just how poor my movement is right now, peeps. Come on, let's go. Run like the wind. Now I think you got to dredge for a message in a bottle. So don't use any bait, is what I think. I think that's what I did. I got one earlier on my PC when I was playing at lunchtime today. So here we go. That's that. Let's give it a go. And I think the fish took all of my bait. Oh, look, I've got 13 baits on at the moment. Oh, dang it. Okay, right. Let's, um, let's take the baits off. Okay, we've got no bait now. 
Coolio. And any second now. There we go. How are we going to get a bottle? We still caught a bloody fish. All right, let's, let's try again. Now, um, locate suitable body water and cast your line. Okay, well, that's what I'm doing. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't program haptics into this. I mean, you've got to look for the line to go green, but it can be jolly difficult if the water is green or if the sky is green to see when it goes green. There we go. Got a message in a bottle. So just don't use any bait, people. There we go. Let's go in then. Let's pop it. A scrap of paper recovered from the bottle, found bobbing in the water. The rumours were true. It's out there. I can feel it. Not here, but somewhere in the water calls to me. I just need to follow its voice. We've got another message in a bottle. I guess. Sweet. Okay, well, we haven't got all the portal glyphs, so I can't go to those glyph destinations, but it might be worth going to them once we have. Heck okay, yeah, okay, what's next then? Freedom of the sea. Release free fish back into the oceans. Okay, have I got free fish that I can do that with? I think I may have already done one anyway. Release a Mondo! I don't think I've got any more. I turned the other one into tuna steak. Haha! <laughs> okay, right, um, I guess we better do a little bit more fishing then. Sweet. Okay, let's um, bait up our rod this time then. Lovely. And we can put pretty much anything on there. Let's try Nip Nip. Okay, it hasn't got a great chance, but you know, I only need to catch one fish and release it. I'm not really bothered what fish I catch, to be fair. Here we go then, people. Right. Come on. Come get your Nip Nip. Nippity Nip. Nip Nip Nip. Come nip on your Nip Nip. Come on. Bob's your uncle. Bobbity Bob. And there we go. Chicka papa! Chicka papa! We got another one of those little tiny scuttlefish. Okay, right. I'll we'll, we'll go release him back into the water. You fly, my pretty fly. Back into the ocean as you go. Okay, well, that's that done then. So I can pop that. Lovely. Sweet. Okay. Exos. Suit skiff plans. I need crystallized sulfide to actually build the dang thing. All right, okay. I've only got one crystallized sulfide on me, and I haven't got any magnetized ferrite. So let's start um, transferring some of my pure ferrite, which I should still have some left, I would have thought, because I'd done loads, didn't I? Into the magnetized variety. And while that's going, we dive into the water and we'll see if we can find some more crystallized sulfide, yeah? I can see some right there, I think. Oh, no. It's not crystallised sulfide. I thought it was. It wasn't. Okay. Well, there's some all the way over there. You see that marker? There we go. Let's go get some from over there. There might have been some right next to me, but, you know, there probably was. we fly all the way over here. We'll swim. Zoom! I'll see you when I get there, people. We have arrived! Okay, right. Here we go. Let's uh, grab that, then. Crystallised sulfide. You know, well, I'll grab a couple of extra ones just in case we need them for anything else. Done. Right. Now I should be able to install a cape, my skiff. There we go. Bang, bang, done. Huh? Oh, yeah. We've still got that going, haven't we, inside of here. And I don't know whether I've got enough, actually. Dang it. No, we have not got enough. Right, we might have to go get some more... Ferrite of the dusts. Right, I'll reconvene once I've got enough ferrite dust turned into magnetised ferrite, shall I? Yes. Well, people, what I might do is put down a base computer here, and then if I can, put down some auto sort of um, fishy things, because I, I got the actual blueprint up in the actual Nexus. So I'm going to stick down one of these, I think. Oh, OK. Might just have to bring my ship closer. I think all my chromatic metal is on my ship. Okay, well, it's not letting me put one down. Cannot build within an existing base. Is there an existing base here? I guess there must be. Okay, right, fine. Well, that that puts pay to that idea anyway, doesn't it? All right, anyhow, I think I've got enough of my metal that I need now, so I can just create the little skiff. There we go. 
done. That's now done. Don't know whether that's a badge to get that done. Okay, catch free fish that are only active during the day. Okay, well apparently I've already caught one anyhow. Let's get my old rod then. Have fishing rig. Let's put some bait on. And oh, I'll just leave the nip nip on for now. Let's see what we get. Come on, little fishy. Fishy, fishy, fishy. You can bob it as well. You can do a little bob like that. Apparently, it, it speeds up the fish coming towards it. Mm, so I've been told. I don't know whether that's true or not. There you go. Oh, oh, come on. You know you want to? Come on. Have a nibble. Have a bite. Come on. Oh, he's had quite a lot of it already. He had three. Okay, we've got a needle fish. Can that, is that only found in the day? Don't know. Let's try again. Go on, little fishes. Boop. Come on. Come on. Come to Stevie. I guess. Oh, he had a bite. We're down to three. Oh, dear me. Don't eat it all. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. Right, we got him. We got one. Oh, we got another message in a bottle. Message in a bottle. Oh, it says use the dangle orb. Okay, well, let's use that then. Let's take that out. And I think I've got dangle orb there. I've got 25 of the dang things. Here we go then. Zoom! Heck yes. Come on, little day fish. Come on. I'm going to get you, little fishy. I'm going to get you, little fish. Go on, little fish. Go on, little fish. I'm going to put a fish on my dish. Go on, little fishy. Come on, little fishy. Fishy on a dish. Fishy on a dish. Come on. That's my fish song. I've been working on it. It needs more work, I think, there. Come on. Take it. Dang it. There we go. We got him. Boom. Heck yes. Common sunfish. Now we just need one more. Plop. There we go. I think we're going to be finishing phase two rather quickly. Because two of the badges we've already done in phase one. I'll hover over them in a minute and show you what I did to get them. Boom. We've got... Py Pyrin fin? Okay. Is that it? Is that a day fish? I guess not. Well, it's a badger that pops up, wouldn't it? Okay, let's try again. I know I've got two now. I thought I just heard something land by me, but I can't be sure. Come on. Oh. Okay. They're nibbling, but they're not actually biting. There we go. Pow! We got another sunfish. That that's done. I think that's all free. There we are. We done it. Sweet. Okay, well, we can pop that then. Craftable component plans. Supreme radiation protection unit. Okay. Oh look at that! We just got a whole load of rassemblages. Sweet. Test the exoskiff. Okay. Um, it's in this menu, isn't it? Is it in this one? Yeah, there you go. There we go. I think we've done that too. I'm going to pop that. Sweet. Mealworms. Five... Yeah, lovely. Cool, we got some new baits. So what's this one? Catch four common irradiated fish. Okay, well this is a hot planet that I'm on right now. So I need to go to a radioactive planet. That... Kind of makes sense, right? Yeah. So let's have a look, see. Let's see if there's a radioactive planet inside of this system, shall we? That one's copper and mordites. That's swamp. That one's copper, pyrite and salt. Pyrite. Pyrite. Is that? No, it's gamma. Gamma that we need, isn't it? Gamma root that we need to find. And none of these are irradiated then, are they? Okay, so I think I'm going to have to go into the old catalogue, like so. And go in... Oh, maybe it might just point me at the right planet anyway. But just in case it doesn't... Hmm. 
materials and items. Can I pick it up from plants? That one there. Okay. There we are. It's even saying you've got to find it on the galaxy map. Right, there we go. Let's go on up through the atmosphere. Up where the air is clear. And let's hope that it's an irradiated planet with water. That's the only problem, isn't it? So, it's found one right there. Hold on. Let me just go to the actual mission on the expedition, because it might give me a surefire hit. Okay. Let's see if it points me to a different planet. It does. Look, it's taking me somewhere else, I think. Oh, no, it's not. It's taking me somewhere completely different. All right, well, let's let's go with that, that one that it gave me. Let's just hope that it's an irradiated planet with water. Okay, I'll see you there. Oh, fudge. I've got a freighter battle going on, people. All right, well, I may have to take out these. I mean, as long if I do get a freighter, at least I've got some extra storage. All right, I'll reconvene in a bit. Okay, John's well. I think I got quite lucky. I got myself an A-class. I scanned it when I was down in the actual foyer. So I know that it's an A-class. Nice. Okay, inspect freighter. Yeah, I take it, mate. I freaking take it. Thank you very much. Lovely jubbly. So cool. I can now squirrel a few things away into here. I mean, the rep repair kit can go there. And all these other bits that, at the moment, I don't think I overly need. So let's, uh, let's put those in there for now. And hopefully we'll be good. OK. Well, I might as well put that in there until I get some more slots and that. Sweet. Oh, cool. We've got a shield module. Freaking lovely. Okay. All right, that'll do as I think. Right. Got ourselves a prey to people. Yeah, not going to complain at that. Pretty darn freaking lovely. Anyways, let's go and have a look to see if this it has got a radiated planet in this system that has water. Let's hope. Whoa, Nelly. Okay, that's not a planet. Planets, planets, where are you? Are you a planet? You are a planet. That's a frost world. I don't think it's got water anyway. Oh, no. Okay, that's um, pyrite. Go on, be irradiated. No, that one's swamp. And I think the others are moons, which aren't going to have water, are they? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah. I don't think we got very lucky on this one, did we? Let's have a quick look at the old discoveries. Hold on, what's the ringed planet? The, there's a ringed planet somewhere in this system. Not that I can see it right now. Let's just pulse this way a little bit. Come on! Move! Dang it, move! Sweet. I'll let you know when I find the planet. Chums, it's a freaking moon! Dang it, it's a moon! Alright. Well, I can only but hope that they've put it on the expedition path. That's the only thing I can hope, people. So let's go on over to Ron the next rendezvous, and let's just hope it's got an irradiated planet with water in this system. Okay, chums. Yes, there is a nuclear planet in here. It seems to be the um, the ringed planet again. So that's cool. Let's go find the ringed planet, and I'll see you down there. Doesn't look like it's got swathes of ocean. It just looks like it's a bit patchy, to be honest. But I'll see you down at the planet. Yeah, I'm coming in for a landing. Now, the plan that I had on the last planet, I think, is still a good plan. Build a couple of bases, put down some auto feeders, and you know we might be able to get. There is a there is a milestone to get over a hundred, a hundred freaking fish. So I'm going to put down a fair few of these bases if I can. There we go, claim base. Sweet. And now that I've claimed the base, I did show a glitching technique on how you can glitch things in. So I should be able to glitch in. The auto feeders, these things, and I got these up inside the Nexus. So hopefully, I can put them in. I think I need to be in the water. Hmm. 
Maybe not then. Okay. Sweet. Okay, let's try that again, but up here. Let's try that. There we go. Got one. I can pick it up. Let's do another one. Let's do a couple. I can only do one at a time. Pick that one up. Pick that one up. Let's do one more. I'll do. Oh, somehow I made it change to purple. That's pretty cool, though. Okay, right. I've got four of them now, so I should be able to put them back into the water. Let's go. One. Oh, okay. Did one at a time again. Two, three. What do you mean I'm missing components? I I, I had four of them. Put it down. There we go. Oh, did I delete it rather than pick it up? I think I did, didn't I? Okay. Okay, we'll just have three. I do. Right, so I've got some I've got some there. I can come back here at some point and, and claim those. But for now we're just gonna do a bit more fishing. There we go. Um yeah, come out of the build menu. Okay, right. Fishing rod. I've still got the day baits on here. And I need to catch how many of those gnarly fish? I've got to catch four of them. Inkier depths. Plumbed the depths. What the fudge? I didn't mean to even do that. I have no idea how I managed to do that, but we'll have a look in a moment. Let's just catch a fish. See if we get an irradiated one. Come on, little get bags. Oh, crud. He ate my bait. I didn't see it go green. I can't see the line. Okay. Because the water's sort of green. I was saying about this earlier, weren't I? Oh, that's a little bit tricky. Did I get one? No. This is hard. Because I can't see the freaking line. Okay, here we go. And there's no, there's no haptic feedback. This is a fun one. I'm just going to have to watch and see when it gets pulled under then, I guess. They need to add haptic feedback on this. And look how much it's moving around. It's so hard to tell when I've got a fish. Oh, man, I'm not going to catch anything. All right. Right, let's, um, let's build something down there. Let's get a little bit closer to the ground. Can we get a bit closer to the ground? Let's... Um, Let's see if I can jump down here and sit on this. Let's see. Oh, fudging heck. All right, well, that didn't work, did it? Yeah! Dang it. As much as I love this game, there's also times where it's really frustrating. Oh no, now look, I've built underneath my freaking fish collectors. Okay. There we go. Hopefully that's good enough. Right, we've got a little landing platform now. Right, let's let's try fishing again. Let's see if I can see my line. But the water's got like a green glow to it, and there's a freaking green sky as well. I can't even see my line. They need haptics on this. We're never going to be able to do this. Okay. Okay, that was a nibble. That was a nibble. That was a nibble. That was a nibble. Frickin' just take it! There we go! Oh, this is a big one! This is a big one! This could be an epic fish! No, it's not. Uh, we've got a bloater though, it's common. Colossal aquatic creature. I wonder if that counted. Let's go in, let's have a quick look. Nope, still doesn't count. No, we get it. 
I'm still using my day bait. I wonder if there's one that increases the chances of getting a radioactive fish or something. Go on then. Oh, 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 oh. Has he got it? No. Oh, Dang it. Come on then, fishes. Oh, fudge. Whoa, I nearly fell in. Let's just go there. Uh-oh. I'm standing on nothing. Aha, I can see the line now because we've got an orange... Uh-oh, oh, I'm falling off, though. Oh, no. Don't fall in. Whoa, Captain. Okay, here we go. You had a nibble? Is that a nibble? He's going to pull me in the ocean. Pow! Come on! Come on! Heck yes! We got him. It's another bloater. That didn't quite work. Right, let's um let's see what we've actually got. It's a phase three badge. Cast your line into deep water. Alright, well, we did that then, I suppose. Okay, right. Let's change the bait on this and let's see if we can get an aquatic fish. Oh no, it's getting rather wavy and davy here. Right, let's see if there's anything else I can put on there. What about if I put on one of these bloaters on there? Let's see what that does. Sa! I'm putting out a big fish to catch an even bigger fish. That's what I'm hoping to do anyway. Oh my god. Go on. Go on, fish. I can't even see the freaking float now. Oh my days. Seriously? I have no, no idea what's going on. I'm going to lose my bait at this rate, aren't I? I can't see. Can't see now. I think it took my... Oh. Fudge! Okay, right. Let's uh, go in here. and Let's try something other than that, because I've only got one left anyway. Go in here. Uh, what have I got a lot of baits of? Let's just try some millworms. That should get me some common fish, I'd imagine. At least I've got lots of it. Get on! Oh my days, this planet's crazy for fishing. Got one! And it looks like a big one! Is it going to be another bloater though? Or is it going to be... It is another bloater. Alright people, I'll let you know when I actually catch a freaking radioactive one. Okay, it says here I caught three enormous fish. Wasn't even trying. Okay, so let's go into... Well, that's a phase four award, apparently. So I'd have that. Oh, small aquarium plants. Aquarium plants? Really? Okay. I don't think I can put my fish inside of it. That would have been... I got excited for a second there, people. It's funny how it says small aquarium. I wonder if they are going to give us large aquariums. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? There we go. Let's give it another go. Come on, little guys. You need to catch one of these radioactive fish. Oh, bite. 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 There we go. This one doesn't look as big as the last two. Here we go. That looks cool. That looks radioactive. Yes. It radiated waters. I think that is one. I think that's one down. Yes, it is. Brilliant. Okay, now we know what we're after. I'll reconvene when I've got a few more. You know what? It's far easier at night time. I can see my line. I can see the fish. Fishing at night is a lot better, isn't it? There you go. It looks like another big bloater, though. I don't think this is... Going to be anything other than the big bloater. There we go. Another another big bloater. Oh, no. This one says radioactive world. Nice. Okay, cool. Sweet. I think that counts. To be honest, it's hard to say. Let me just double check. Let's see if that's moved up to two or four now. No, it didn't count. Dang it. Oh, she look at that. I got myself a peppery one, an A-class, aquatic creature found in the irradiated waters. That's got to count. So surely that's got to count. Yes, yes, I've got two or four. Brilliant. Okay. 
Okay, chums. This one says it's only seen at night, but it also says it's radioactive, so I think I might have done it. Let's have a look. Have I done it? No. It still says three or four. Oh, that's... Dang it! I got all excited. We got a super rare one. Look, another purple one. It's like a colossal aquatic squid thing. Did that count? Yes, we did it. We freaking did it. There goes. Okay, right. We can pop that badge then. Done. Ban hazard protection upgrade and three times hypnotic eyes. Sweet. And we can now pop this, which is going to give us deep sea flippers and deep sea leggings. Heck yes. Coolio. Well, I can go up to the spatial, well, the Nexus thing, or the space anomaly, and uh, yeah, I can look into that. Let's let's see if anything's inside of my automated traps. Yes, we've got a fish inside of there. Okay, well, we're kind of getting low on space anyway. So I'm just going to go up to the old Nexus, or space anomaly, whatever you want to call it. And uh, yeah, hopefully, I'm just going to change my appearance when we're up there, people. Cool, I'll see you up there. Okay, well I'm at the old appearance modifier. Let's jump on in, shall we? Let's have a quick look-see what I can pick on up in here. So what did I get? I got leggings, didn't I? So is it these ones? Deep sea legs? I guess. Let's change the markings to three. Red, white and black. I think that's pretty good. Then we we'll go for the boots. Go for, I think it's number eight. Put it on the end leg, on the end markings. And there we go. I think that's looking pretty darn freaking dapper, isn't it? You know what? I might put that to red on that sort of level. Yes, that's that's awesome. Okay. Well, yeah, we'll we save the settings there. And there we go, people. I've now got the leggings. I mean, look at that. Isn't that pretty darn freaking lovely? Well, I think it looks pretty darn freaking lovely. Right, we're going to head back down to my ship, jump in my ship, out of my ship. And then we'll be heading to the next part of the, well, the phases which is phase three that we're going to be doing next, people. So, awesome. Awesome times. We're making good progress on this, I think, people. Yeah, so let's uh, make sure that I've definitely saved everything by jumping in and out. Sweet. We're jumping in. Jumping out. Done, dilly, and done. Now, I don't know where you're supposed to sell your fish to. Maybe you sell your fish at Cronus or something. But I've got quite a fair few fish to now stow away and sell. Well, I should have anyway. Yeah, quite a lot. Here you go. We'll try selling them to Kronos next episode, people. Till next time, salute Mondo. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again. Yeah,